Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. IRS Nationwide Tax Forum kicks off July 19th, and you best be there, or the IRS may kick you off. Just kidding. I don't even know what that means. But first, an attempt at a joke. Dealing with this administration's like living with someone who's eating you out of house and home. Eating me out of house and home. Using up my hot water. Except that this administration drives you out with inflation. That's inflation for you. At least with the dude that was eating you out of house and home, somebody's getting fed. Please stop stuffing your face. Dealing with this administration's more like having that dude take your food, but rather than eat it, they throw it in your face. A food fight. <laughs> and then they try to come up with some long explanation about how somebody else actually was the one who threw your own food in your face. You don't understand, Mom. You just don't understand. And you're like, but wait a second here, I saw you. I saw you take it, I saw Like five seconds ago, throw my own food in my face. But they're like, no, you don't understand. It was Putin. Come here from Russia. And then he colluded with like that guy that runs the gas station down at the corner. They're totally the ones that threw your own food in your face. And you should totally be pissed at those food throwing people. I, I don't buy it. I, I don't buy it. I don't buy it. I don't buy it either. July 14th is the last day to register for all 32 webinars. IRS YouTube video on down below for the 2022 IRS Nationwide Tax Forum. There's a link to that here. IR 2022-134, July 11th, 2022, Washington. This Thursday, July 14th, is the last day for tax professionals to register to attend the 2022 IRS Nationwide Tax Forum and have access to all 32 webinars, including a keynote address by IRS Commissioner Chuck Reddick, updated on tax law, cybersecurity, practitioner ethics, and more. There's even more than those wonderful topics when you go to this event. The 2021 virtual event is being held over a five-week period from July 19th through August 18th. Webinars will be live streamed on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday of each week. So you still have like Monday and like Friday as well as like the weekend, which you would normally have to rock and roll or whatever. So to guarantee access to a webinar, registration must be completed a minimum of three business days in advance. Participants who register after July 14th will not have access to the full lineup of webinars. And you want access to the full lineup, let me tell you what. Practitioners are encouraged to view the forum schedule. There's a link to that forum schedule here and course descriptions. There's a link to the course descriptions and you're encouraged to click those links as they state to plan their experience. For more information to register, you can visit IRS Nationwide Tax Forum. And there's a link to that here. Tax Forum Virtual Expo ex uh, included with their registration. The attendees may also visit the forum's virtual expo with dozens of ex uh, exhibitors representing tax and business services, IRS associate and partners, and key IRS offices and initiatives in the quote, IRS zone, end quote. It's like the end zone, but it's the IRS zone. So the expo will be staffed from noon, 2 p.m. and 3 to 5 p.m. Uh, Eastern uh, time every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, as we said before, giving you that Monday and Friday for those long, super long weekends, permitting attendees to interact with uh, exhibitors. Whoever, uh, however, uh, registrants will have access to most expo context 24 hours a day from the entire length of the forum. Focus groups and digital product demos. That's going to be interesting stuff. As a special feature of the 2022 forum, the IRS invites attendees to participate in one or more virtual focus groups. Focus groups, uh, groups are arranged around the following topics. So this is the focus of the focus group, if you will, hence the name of the focus group. Improving the taxpayer experience and IRS services, improving the taxpayer experience and IRS outreach. We certainly need some focusing on those with those, get some groups together on those things. 
Tax Pro account and business online account, digital asset uh, transactions, tax treatment of retirement distributions, Affordable Care Act forms, IRS online accounts, responding to IRS correspondence audit notices, taxpayer civil rights. Are your clients receiving the services they need? Online tax tools and resources for refundable credits, the past, the present, and the future. Ooh, that's the catchiest name of all of them. Very creative name on that one. So in addition, in addition to our focus groups, the Office of Online Services will conduct uh, demonstrations of the IRS Tax Pro and individual online accounts, demonstrations live of IRS stuff, continuing education, CE. So this is what people are really looking for, right? Finally, just tell me how many, how many credits can I get on this before I get into my long weekends on the Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Attendance at any of the 2022 nationwide tax form webinars qualifies as continuing education, CE for enrolled agents, certified public accountants, annual filing season program participants, California Tax Education Council, CTEC, participants and certified financial planners, CFP. Note, with four seminars this year presented in both English and Spanish, participants can earn up to 28 continuing education credits. Well, that sounds good. As long as I got those long weekends in there. Attorneys, uh, please check with your state bar to determine whether participation in the IRS Nationwide Tax Form Seminars qualifies for continuing legal education credit. Visit the CE and CFP certification page. There's a link to that here for more information. Registration information. Here's what you need, people, to get this done. For more information and to register online, you can visit IRS Nationwide Tax Forum. There's a link to here. There's links to that other stuff. All the stuff that I said there's a link to, it's on, it's on this page. And there'll be a link to this in the description.